Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to sell Printful with Amazon. So I will show you how to start creating your product guys on Printful and then sell them on Amazon. That tutorial will work for you really easy, really simple. All I need you to do guys is watch it from now till the end so you can understand everything uh, like from A to Z. Now, let's start by going to the Printful website. So here we go, Printful and click on printful.com. So this is the website that we are going to use. Now from here guys, make sure that you are logged into your account. Let me just show you an example. You can log in by clicking on let's go. And here you can sign up by using Facebook, Gmail or Apple account. Else, you can just sign up with your own email. So it's gonna be something like that. Now for me, I have already an account, so I will just click on sign in and I will sign in with my Google account. So it's gonna be something like that. Pretty easy and pretty quick. Now, what we must do next is create our first product. So how we can do that? You can just go to product template and from here, create your first product template. So let's create a product template. And here I'm going to men's clothing. And I'm going to choose, for example, um, all men's clothing. And here I'm going to search for a hoodie from here. So here we go, hoodie. And let's find some good looking hoodie. For example, this one. So here it goes. And now guys, what I'm going to do simply is add some kind of a design. I'm going to add like a random image. It is not a professional image at all. So this is like only for tutorial. But you guys make sure to make your own designs, make it look good so you can attract more people to buy your own t-shirt or products. Now let's name it for example, hoodie for tutorial, Amazon. And let's click on save product template. Now, what you must do is simply go to Amazon. So let's go to Amazon.com. And here, all I'm going to do is sign into my account. So I'm already in my account. Now, let's go back here and go to here, stores. And of course, click on choose platform. So let's choose the platform, which is Amazon in our case. So here it goes. So here it is. Here it is, Amazon Marketplace, the world's most popular online marketplace. You can use whatever marketplace from here. So there's not only Amazon, there's multiple options. So here I'm going to click on connect. And now they will show me how I can actually do that. So first of all, the first step is register for an Amazon Seller Center account. How to do that? Click on here to register a new one. And here just click on sign up. And of course, just wait a little bit, log into your account and that's it so let me just find my password real quick and i will be right back to you guys back to you guys so now i'm going to put my two-step verification code so typically now what i'm going to do so let's go to my phone authenticator and here amazon so it's going to be 519266 and sign in so there was a problem is incorrect let me just do it again next and let's try the OTP once more. So here we go. And I am connected now, so that's good. So now let's click on begin. And it is pretty easy from now. It's gonna be simple and fast. I can continue. So here let's choose a country. So for me, it's Morocco. You can choose USA, you can choose whatever you like. So let's check if it has Morocco in here. If not, we'll have to choose another country. So here it is, Morocco. Here business type. Uh, charity, privately owned business, and business name, for example, we can choose um, Loli Tutorial. So please ensure your business type selection is correct. Now I'm going to choose make sure if it is correctly. Yep. And now let's go here. I confirm and agree and continue. Now, guys, what I'm going to do is wait for it until it loads. So let's wait for it. And um. I'm not sure how long it's gonna take. So, okay, here we go. And now all you need to do guys is fill this information with your business information, seller information, billing, store, and verification. So that's how it's gonna be. Here, your company registration number. Here, your registered business address. So it's gonna be something like so, something random like that. Here, yeah, however you would like to receive your PIN. So here you're gonna uh, have your phone verification number and they will send you a code. So you must 
but it is choose whether you want it to be a call or SMS. So after that, here the uh, SMS verification uh, language, and after that, here you put like the verification. So let me just do that real quick. So I'm going here to put my phone number. I'm going to my phone number. Go to here, and here we go. So six four five seven three five four nine four and i will try to do that so let's click here to send sms i'm going here to add actually the uh, captcha so c for c5 and send sms now let's see if they are going to send it all right captcha validation field okay so 6s 286 and t here we go now send sms okay that's good and let's check if they are going to send me the actual sms so here we go amazon and so let's try this for example 40486 and let's try to check verify all right it is the wrong one i must have waited much longer but anyway i have a bug a bug that doesn't allow amazon to send me sms for some reasons but overall that's what you have to do is verify it click on next and then have here your seller information so here you will put your name full name nickname uh, etc and uh, your date of birth where do you live your address and then your card id information and then they will ask you for some uh, pictures for about you and about your card of uh, card id or your driver license it depends on what kind of uh, verifying uh, document you have chosen after that you will go to the billing so here you will choose how you want to be paid so whether you want paypal credit card your bank account directly or cash and delivery so it depends here the store and here verification so these are the like the fastest or the easiest things now as you finish with that you have to choose the amazon regions you want to sell on which is here they allow us canada mexico uk french uh, germany here italy Spain, Netherlands, and Brazil. After that, if you have like connect your principal account to Amazon, choose the region you want to sell on. So here, you click on North America, for example. You click on Authorize. If you want here Europe, you click here to Authorize. So here we go to the third step, which is set up your brand name and G T E N exemption. So this selection will be available after you complete step two. So make sure to follow this. Uh, authorize it so click here for example uh, when you create your account in here after that all you need to do guys is simply verify it so let me just put here the OTP so something like that and sign in all right here all you need to do is choose for example where you want it to be so we're gonna be something like that Se select the merchants and marketplace select account and as you can see now what is doing basically is choosing where i'm going to sell so let's give it some time and yeah it can take a lot of time actually guys but overall this is like the idea and then of course they took me to this step again because i didn't fill my information but overall they will not take you here they will just take you directly to the third step and then the fourth step so yeah guys that is basically it that's how you can actually buy your products that you have created on price for on amazon so thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next video